You know, the railroad. Cue the music. It's time of the year for some haunts and spooky happenings there on the railroad. It's colorful Colorado, too. Yeah, and what better way to go take in the Golden Aspens than up at the Georgetown Loop Railroad? Yeah. Plus, they've also got some really fun fall festivals. So Tom Hill is here to share the details along with some, I don't know, I don't know what to call her, super scary monster she, over she there. Your lady bring? friend? <laughs> <laughs> That's Charlie. Hi, Charlie. Hi, Charlie. How's it going? Rough night? Yeah, a little stiff, but I'm okay. <laughs> so, anyway. should we get right into it, or yeah, should we talk about the fall colors? What should we talk well, about? Well, fall colors <clears throat> still holding up. We're starting to get a frost a little bit. Yes. So, maybe it's sooner than better that you might get up there. I'm hoping we're going to go all the way through the middle of October, because we really started late with yeah. the colors this year. They just... Hung on and hung on and didn't get going and didn't get going. But they're so this now? weekend would really Come be out? the perfect weekend. <clears throat> perfect there. weekend. Okay. And we've got a, a couple of specials. Uh, one is, and we're at the tail end of our specials, by the way, so if you want to get one, you better get on it. Do it now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We've got the $7 off on the first train of the day on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, this Friday, Saturday, deal. and Sunday are mm -hmm. the last ones. Nice. That's up at Silver Plume. You can't switch it around, but it saves you 7 bucks on every ticket. Very it's nice. not a bad mm -hmm. deal. Cool. All right, so you have so much going on for fall. Um, you know, tell us about some of the special activities on the horizon. Okay. Uh, well, we've got the Pumpkin Festival, and that's for the kids. I think it's for the kids. <laughs> A lot of kids that are in their 40s. But anyway, <laughs> uh, we have the Haunted uh, the We don't have, have that this year. We have the Bouncy Castle. We've got, I think, hot dogs. We've got uh, face painting. And the root beer. Yeah, yeah, well, that's another activity. Okay, well, you do serve root beer. It's really good. Yeah, we do serve root beer. <laughs> Where does the root beer belong? Is it in the Oktoberfest? Yeah. Oh, you then let's put, talk about you can, that. You can't put beer in the middle of a pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, all, all, the, all, the, all, the, all the kids get free pumpkins, though, so that's pretty good. <laughs> all right, no. tell us about Oktoberfest. Well, Oktoberfest is... A lot of people's favorite time of the year. I don't know. I guess there's a lot of beer drinkers out there. Yes. But uh, we've got a couple of local breweries that supply our beer. Uh, I think Winella Pass Brewery and you know, who is? Tommy Knockers. Tommy Knockers, yeah. yeah. They're both locals up in the mountains. And uh, they serve a lot of beers that are also only made at this time of the year. So they're specialty beers. Okay. Uh, we serve root beer also for the kids because it's not just an adult activity. But they don't get to have any pumpkins with it. Let me no, 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 no we got to separate no the pumpkins two. No pumpkins with the root beer. <laughs> and uh, last week when I was here, I dropped off some bratwurst. They're like the bratwurst. Yeah, but that was a good lunch. That was so Thank delicious. You. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, we got 6,000 more coming, I think. That's all? Yeah. So <laughs> I think we're going to have plenty right? of prompt. Yeah, yeah, they're all from Continental. All these local. That's great. great. And we, we try and buy local. Yeah, yeah That's really worthwhile. Yeah. All right. Fun. So let's talk about the elephant in the room, and that's your friend <laughs> sitting next to you. Where does she belong? Is it the Haunted Mine Tour? The Pumpkin Fest, Oktoberfest, where does she belong? Well, there are some people there that says she belongs back in her casket. <laughs> that's true. But no, that's not true. Oh. Uh, we dug story? her up a oh, couple well, she, We dug her up a couple of years ago. So yeah. I'll let, let you. A little tell stiff them. from, you know, 83. I'd say 1883. 1883. 1883. Is that where you came from? 1883. Wow. This is what happens when you play with dynamite. You know, <laughs> oh it, my God. you've got to be real careful together. with that. You got to be real careful with that. So when you guys come up to the Haunted Mine Tour, you might see anything that happens in that mine. Right, right. And something might sometimes follow you home. And it's pretty dark in there. Yeah, because yes, I'm is. looking at the video here. Ooh. It's very dark in there, and we don't know what's going to happen. And sometimes we don't even have people come into the mine. And we have a Too little scared. scavenger Too hunt. Too scared yeah. to step in, right? Yeah, if you find something like that. What the heck is that? I'm this is your present. Ah! Just for oh my you. Gosh. <laughs> you got to come back live so I can show this. Is this an eyeball, an this, old eyeball well, yeah, from 1883? Oh, God. I'm still yeah. looking for Here, it. Give it back to her. I'm still looking for it. Tom, can you this? just like. Oh. <laughs> you need I tried. A third. I tried. Oh, wow. You need one of those beers. Yes, Charlie. she really does. Yes. And brought. Sounds good brought. to me. <laughs> All right, here's that deal again. You're going to pay $28 for two coach tickets to ride the Georgetown Loop Railroad. That is a $55 value, and it's good for rides Monday through Friday. KDVR.com. Click on deals. Have a haunted day, everybody. And don't lose your eyeballs. <laughs>